Hi everyone, welcome to Laura's Kitchen once again. Today I'll be teaching you guys how to make fruit cake. I love fruit cake so so much. I don't joke with fruit cake. Whenever it comes to fruit cake, I can even steal for it. I love it very very well. Stay tuned as we learn how to make fruit cake. Don't go anywhere. Stay with me. And for this recipe, I'll be needing 120 gram of butter, one and half cup of flour, six eggs, half cup of sugar. We also have our dried fruits and our fried cashew nuts. One and a half tablespoon of nutmeg, grinded nutmeg. One tablespoon of baking powder. Four tablespoon of powdered milk flavor. Half teaspoon of salt. Our strawberry flavor. And our butterscotch flavor. Okay, I already have my butter in the bowl. I'll be adding my sugar to it also. I'll be using my hand mixer to mix the both of them together. I'll keep mixing till it becomes fluffy. As you can see, it's already fluffy. I'll be adding two cup full of butterscotch flavor and my strawberry flavor. Then I'll mix all together. Okay, I'll set that aside. It's time to mix the dry ingredients. I'll be adding everything together. The flour, the nutmeg, the milk and the rest of them. I'll be mixing everything together. Then I'll set aside. Time to add the dry ingredients and the wet ingredients. I'll be making use of alternative method. I'll explain more about that in my description box. I'll be adding a little of my flour. Then I'll mix, mix everything together. Then I'll be introducing my egg, a little egg, a little quantity at a time. I'll be adding a little flour and a little egg until I've exhausted the whole ingredients. Keep mixing till everything is well incorporated. Our cake batter is ready. Okay, we'll be greasing our pan with oil. We'll be making use of 8 inch pan. We'll be greasing it with granite oil. You can use any oil of your choice. Then you just have to brush it up, brush everything, brush the oil around the pan so that it goes round. We'll be adding a little flour to the pan. To coat the oil, it makes the cake come out very nice, very sweet and fresh. So we'll just be coating it all the floor, coat the pan, everything the floor, make sure it goes around the pan very well. It's time to transfer the cake batter into the pan. Transfer everything. Then we heat the pan very well we heat it on the surface very well the essence is to remove excess air bubble then our fruit comes in our dry fruits of the cashew nuts and the dry fruit comes in and we'll be baking for 45 minutes in a preheated oven after 45 minutes our cake is ready oh my god i feel like eating it already Wow, our cake is so so lovely. Thanks guys for your patience. Thanks for your time, your whole time and everything. Thanks guys. Thanks once again. Please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please, I'm on my knees. 
please subscribe and share with your friends tell them to subscribe too thank you all i love you all